Hello and welcome to my YouTube web channel. Uh, appreciate you watching. This uh, video is where I made an Arduino sketch that will hold uh, many sketches. It's one program that I've designed with a menu that will hold uh, a lot of sketches. And you can see if you press A, it will turn it off right there. And if you turn, press B, it will turn it off right there. And this right here actually controls the uh, menus that you're looking for. If you look, I'm going to go up to <coughs> menu 1, and I click on it, it will uh, make the LEDs, and that's an example for you. And uh, you can see the LEDs like that. But anyway, that's fun. Uh, and you push it again, and it will turn it off. And if you change it, you can change the menu with that uh, pad. Just a, it adjusts the rate, but it takes a second for it to refresh and program and uh, the window. So give it a couple of seconds and then it'll uh, start pretty fast. Uh, enough of that. Okay, so about um, this, the you know, sketch itself, the program, uh, there's a lot of description here on how to hook it up. And uh, when you first part of this up, I, I wanted to mention it this fast. When you first power it up, or we'll reset it, it's going to give you the file name, which uh, if you look over here, the string is where I keep track of the, uh, what it's actually uh, the file name. So it's a good idea to update that if you change that. And also it goes to, uh, in the setup, it goes to uh, iTunes scan, which is a function of the end, and it tell you your address on this on the serial monitor so that you can change that up here in the uh, liquid crystal. I have two liquid crystals. One of them is a 27 address, and this one is a 3 up. So I am kind of this one, so I can use that. So that works pretty good. That's a good diagnostic tool for just hooking up for the first time, hooking up your LCD screen. A little bit about the, uh, let's look at menu 1, uh, what I did there. Okay, let's do a control C to copy that, control F to find, and V to put that in there, and then uh, do a find. And then you can do a that one. Okay, this is in case one right here. Uh, this is the main menu I'm using, uh, switching case to find these. And right there it goes to the function menu. Okay. Right here it's saying menu one drop the cross A. This is the case where it works for it. And uh, that's the name. This right here is actually the function for it. If you look right here, this is the function. Uh, this would be the equivalent to the setup area in the regular sketch. And uh, you can see I put a few extra things in there. And this would be the end of your setup. After the while statement, you can put your functions here, and that's exactly what I did. I put the, uh, I see which one is this, is the LED. So I'm here using the, uh, instead of using the layout, uh, current uh, mills to uh, actually use it as the layout. And here is the second menu, this is what I call the side on right here. Actually, uh, it goes back and forth on the LCD uh, itself. Uh, and you can adjust the rates, if you look right here, you can adjust how fast it goes back and forth. Of course, you have to wait for it to go through one side. But uh, let's go back and look at a few other functions. Uh, by to C address. Of course, power is up. Or it goes through that and start. And we have, uh, these are all the uh, functions list right here if you want to go to one like uh, and also in the contents if you just want to so if you just want to find something like uh, I have another connection uh, thing at the end just do control C, control F, and then control V and uh it's going to the end where I have uh, a little bit better detail of how everything's connected. 
good news here. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope this is helpful. I really enjoyed making this, and I hope that if you uh, look into this and you play around with it and you like it and you add more stuff to it or you make it more streamlined or simple to use, please comment and keep the uh, forum going on this. I, I really enjoyed putting this one together. I've uh, done a lot of research into it. I'm kind of new at this, but uh, I wanted something kind of nice and neat that did a lot of stuff. And that's what this did. So uh, this is like the third version of it. So uh, go to GitHub if you want to get this code and enjoy it. Hope you like it. Let me know what you think.